All right, this is going to be a real quick review of the Swiss Gear Alpine Peak 2 two man tent from Target. I believe this was like 60 bucks whenever I got it. If you look at the specifications here, I'll focus. There it goes. It says it's 58 inches wide, 84 inches long, 45 inches tall. Um, the 45 inches height is probably pretty accurate. I would say there's about 50 inches of like usable space. Um, and I don't know about, I'd say 76 length. Um, it's a really, really good one man tent. Uh, obviously two man be crammed in there just like always, but, um, I've used this tent, uh, use it off of a motorcycle. Um, I use it at the uh, Smokeout Rally in Rockingham, North Carolina, and slept in it for three days. Uh, rained one of those days. Um, you know, slight wind, nothing real crazy, but it held up really good with uh, with the tent completely got out at all the points that you can. It's like it's really sturdy, a lot more than you probably would think by looking at it. It's freestanding. Uh, not a lot of mesh so the wind blowing like a driving rain you want to worry about it coming up in over the uh, over the uh, panels and hitting the mesh which is as you can see these two panels here at the top Drop way down so you can see it there. and they actually surprisingly do a pretty good job of ventilating um, if you need more you have the windows on the back and the little dog also up here at the top the door um, a few things I added a carabiner I hang you a lamp lantern Headlamp, whatever. Uh, I used the gear loft loops to actually put a, a clothesline in with a no slip knot. Just tied it up myself. Um, I've been very satisfied with this tent. I got my single sleeper, my sheets on it, my pillow over here to the side. Got room for my pack over here in the corner. Uh, plenty of extra room. As you can see, to put pretty much whatever. In my case, be like uh, movable bags, saddle bags, and such. But backpacks, definitely. Um, you take the rain fly off so you can see it without it. You got it tied up there pretty good right now. Sit still. Have it tied up there at the top, but you can see it comes with a support pole for the rain fly. Really, really good setup. I was kind of worried about leaving the windows open and also to wrap around because if you notice the rain fly kind of open depending on the angle of the wind, but I haven't had any trouble with that. Any wind that blew rain hit the fly and just went down and drained out, especially when it got out and uh been very satisfied with it. Um, plan on taking it on a cross country trip probably next year or the year after. And there'll be a lot of setting up camp, uh, breaking it down the next day, and hopefully riding hundreds and hundreds of miles and <laughs> setting it back up. But we'll see. So, thanks for watching my review. Hope it was helpful.